each presentation there will be one slide, 180 seconds presentations, and no questions allowed. Okay, three minutes, no questions, and we start now. Start definitely by giving a very brief introduction that makes people understand why this is interesting, and ends by saying where you will be found later on. You can say where you're from and your affiliation and so on, but that's not really the critical thing. The critical thing is to attract people's attention. Follow the following. Why is this interesting? What is this about? Um, how you have done it and with whom. Always look at the audience, don't lose eye contact, keep scanning the room left and right, do not turn your back. In the flash talk you need it to develop in some way, right? You want to build up the kind of anticipation and the attention of the, uh, the people who are listening. So you can start perhaps with your rationale, your question, and maybe at the end you want to leave them hanging a little bit. You might want to put out something that you've uh, investigated but not yet tell them the whole story. It's going to be short so they're going to be generally paying attention to you, but obviously if you use some sort of dynamics in the tone of your voice that's going to be very important. So you build up to something or you clearly emphasize one or two points. Those those are the sort of things that are going to bring their attention to the most important parts. You can use props in your flash talk. Um, you can bring in diagrams and other things. They attract a lot of attention. Um, if that fits with your character, you can try to make people laugh. You can do something uh, that they're not expecting. That's very effective. But I think you got to remember that it should be matched somehow to who you are so that it appears natural. Avoid too many special effects, the abuse of PowerPoint special effects. If your science is good, it doesn't need any fireworks, it will speak for itself. You should definitely have the poster number on the, on, during your flash talk to be sure that people will come and see you later on. To make your flash talk stand out, you can use all, some sort of unusual or alternative uh, method. So graphics is one thing. You're going to probably be able to have one slide. You want your graphics to be dynamic. They can be some sort of image and there should be very little information or a minimum information on your, on your slides to try to bring people into the main message the thing that they're going to remember. I mean, like all talks, I think you have to practice and it has to be perfect beforehand. So even if you want to bring across that you're relaxed and this is a very informal event, you've got to practice to be prepared. Avoid to go too long. Stick to the time. If you have one minute, one minute. If you have two minutes, two minutes. Don't go too long. Be enthusiastic. I think, you know, if you're enthusiastic about your science, people will come along and will want to know more.